Some of us have sex down to a science, say by the time we're 25. Not all of us though are blessing our sexual prowess, or rather preparing for sex, as the bus seems to have missed us. Here are five things one need to do in preparation for sex. Number one, communicate. In the technological hookup culture of Tinder and others, it's way easier to have a one night stand, except we don't ask the necessary hard questions. When hooking up, please make your intentions clear. No beating around the bush. Make sure everyone is on the same page, especially when taking someone's virginity. They can get clingy. So if you're not into kissing or oral, say so from the get-go, as no one wants half a sex. On one important side note though, you should always ask a person's HIV slash STD status whether or not they're offended by the question. Number two, shower. I can't stress this enough. Please shower before you show up to someone's house for sex. No one wants a sweaty ass, a smelly vagina, or a dirty penis. J just shower. Three, change your clothes. This goes for you smokers and those of you who think it's okay to wear the same clothes five days in a row. It's counterproductive to shower and then throw on some dirty clothes. Uh, no bueno. Wearing dirty clothes means you'll be transferring all the odors back onto your body. So change it up. Number four, brush your teeth. Breath mints alone won't work, my friend. You can show up expecting to be kissed with bad or stale breath. Not happening. Toothpaste is way too cheap, so make the most of it and brush your teeth prior to meeting. Flossing and rinsing doesn't hurt either. Number five, douche. Yeah, I said it. If you're gonna have anal sex and you know ahead of time, please douche as no one wants a shitty situation. Pun intended. Those are five things to help you prepare for your next sexual encounters. Until next time, I'm Terrain.